Hello everybody, welcome again. So this is my video on how to go back to the stock gingerbread firmware. And also I'm showing you how to root and get the clockwork recovery mode. So if you don't want the root and the clockwork mode, just follow this video till you get the official stock firmware. So what you need to do is it doesn't matter whatever you are running, just hold the volume, just reboot into recovery. So once you reboot into recovery, do a Y beta factory reset. Wipe cache. And go to advanced. And do a wipe Dalvik cache. Now go back. Now you should turn off your phone, you don't get the power of op option, so you need to unplug your battery. So once you have uh, done that, it's the PC part. So your PC must have the Samsung keys and the PC Odin installed on it. So check the description, I have provided the download links. And once you have Samsung keys and PC Odin installed on your PC, so download the link 3 and the link 4, you'll get these two files and extract it in different folders. So if you extract the link 3, you'll get this MD5 file. And if you extract the link 2, you'll get these files. The GMS file. So what you need to do is now, onto your mobile phone, hold the volume down, power and the home keys this time. You'll get this. Now hit volume up to continue. Now connect your phone to your PC via the USB cable and leave it as it is. Now open the mobile Odin, uh, sorry the PC Odin. Okay. Okay, now what you need to do is hit PDA and select the extracted file of the link 3. That is the .tarmd5 file hit open and hit start okay so once it says pass just unplug your phone Okay, so we are up here. Just let me skip the basic settings. Okay, so we are running the stock official gingerbread firmware. Just show you. Okay, this is the gingerbread Android 2.3.6, and this is the official firmware. So if you want to root and add the clockwork recovery mode, what you, do, what you need to do is go to settings and in the application tab check unknown sources and go to development tick USB debugging now connect your phone to the PC via the USB cable again and just leave it as it is and now go to the extracted file of the link 4 that is the initial CF root flasher. So you get these files. Now open the not rooted yet dot bat file. You'll get this. Press any key. So this will take a bit of time. So just keep waiting and follow the on, on screen instructions. Okay, so it says press any key. Again, pre again press any key to continue and now unplug your phone from the computer now the phone will automatically reboot okay now you can see that we have the clockwork mode and the super user so that's pretty much it so now you can go ahead and try different ROMs or if you want to stay in the stock ROM you can stay 
with the stock ROM. So that's pretty much it. So thanks a lot for watching. Bye bye now and have a good day.